And I know people are going to be pissed off. There's going to be people in these comments being like, no, you can't hate it. Hey friend, welcome to my living room. <laughs> um, well, uh, we are in the living room today because as of about one to two weeks ago, we were kicked out of the studio because if you're unawares or haven't been following, we have been renovating our back garage into our art studio and like we're blowing it all up in there. We're adding a kitchen and a bathroom. There was already a kitchen and a bathroom in it, but it's gonna look different. It's gonna look way cuter. Um, and for those of you who have been following on along with the art studio renovations, um, we finally have windows on both sides of the studio. The door, the main door, that's gonna be our antique door is framed out. And we had an electrician in here all last week, um, putting all the wires in all of the spots with all of the little boxes. Um, and so there's a lot of exposed wires and studs, no drywall up yet on the interior. So they put the two by fours all the way around and then the wall with the AC unit, we're gonna be moving the AC unit up a little bit and we're getting like a custom cabinet slash Murphy bed situation built for that wall. And there's gonna be a wood grate that's built in with that that covers the AC unit too. Um, so it's gonna have a bunch of shelves kind of in an upside down U shape around a full size uh, Murphy bed that we can pull down um, for whenever guests come. And then the wall to the right with the windows is gonna be where our desks go, maybe a cute tree or plant um, in between our desks or some cute storage. We will also, also the floor was ripped up and we're gonna do um, a white concrete and the massive huge debate is about the ceiling. That has been something that's been debated on my Instagram and on YouTube for months now. And whenever I talk about it, there is full blown rioting in the streets about whether we should paint it or not. And I've gone back and forth about if we should just leave it or maybe just paint the ceiling and not the beams or if we should uh, stain it so it's a lighter color wood. And because where the old bathroom was doesn't have the beams on the ceiling um, and it's not gonna match if we get a wood to finish that out, um, we're gonna paint it. And I know people are gonna be pissed off. There's gonna be people in these comments being like, no! You can't paint it! You can't paint it white! You're breaking my heart. I know, but it's what we're gonna do. And it's gonna blow up the light in there. It's gonna make it like a white box and I'm gonna be blind and it's gonna be awesome. I love natural light and I love blinding myself with natural light. So we're gonna have a white freaking floor, white walls and a white freaking ceiling. So, shuck it up. And then, uh, yeah, you see the bathroom framed. Uh, the bathroom is framed and we're gonna have some zalige tile in a checkerboard pattern in this like tannish color and a white color um, all the way on the floor and the, not the ceiling, the walls. Um, and some cute stuff for the vanity in the shower, like brass fixtures um, and a toilet because we all gotta go potty sometimes. And then we are getting a kitchen built out next to the front door to the left. That's gonna be bomb also. Just, you know, all the inspiration around. We're gonna have photo shoots on photo shoots on photo shoots. And it's gonna be a beautiful new space to film these videos in once it's all done. So it's a bit dusty right now. It's a bit like, oh my gosh, is this ever going to end? Uh, will we ever have our deck back? Will we ever not have stuff on our grass? I don't know. And that's kind of how I feel right now. It's dramatic, but it just feels like it's never ending. And that's fine. I'm very grateful. But yeah, I, I would like to have some more space to get some work done and um, less dust. 
but I'm super excited for the finished product. That's what's keeping my, my eyes on the prize is that it's gonna look awesome when it's done and we're gonna be, we're gonna have a very comfortable studio space for filming with all this freaking gear that John has. And um, we're gonna just feel inspired every time we walk into our art studio and just feel like, ooh, this is nice. So current day is August 23rd. August 23rd. Um, we started this project June 4th, broke ground June 4th. And um, what is today? August 23rd, so two months in. But the timeline for this all being finished is end of September. So in about six, five weeks. <sighs> but I think that's like everything being done. So we might be able to move in sooner. I don't know, contractors in the comments. What do you think? We have a lot of contractors in our uh, <laughs> Jenna Rainey audience. You never know. So whenever that final move-in day officially happens, we're gonna be moved in. And once that's all settled, we are gonna bang out all of the videos for the new course. I have been working on a brand new course called The Art Within, which is about um, the art of flow state and the science of flow state to help you get into flow state and create your best original work. Um, so I'm covering the foundations of sketching and doodling exercises that are gonna help you tap into flow state and develop your motor, motor skills. And then more like um, I'm having some guest experts on that will guide us through meditation and breath work and other processes that I implement in order to get into flow state and my process before painting um, and doing anything creative, even playing piano. And so um, I have been writing that uh, here on the kitchen table, here on the floor, in our bedroom, on my little laptop, and just kind of focusing on um, writing this course. The outline, I built out all the scripts and um, we'll be doing the sales page next. If you want to check out that course or maybe get on the wait list, we're going to be launching it this fall, November 2022. Um, but the wait list or link to it is jennarainey.com forward slash art dash studio dash wait list. So you can check that out. The link will probably be in the description. It's going to be an amazing course. But that has been what I've been working on like a little machine um, for the past couple of weeks. John was out of town last week in Colorado with his parents, had a lovely time in Telluride area. So me and Miles, our three-year-old son, um, went to the beach a lot and I worked when he napped and when he was at school, which he's at right now. Um, but anyway, that's kind of the rundown. Anything else, John, what have I missed? We had to film some Patreon exclusive stuff today in the living room, which was quite tight. And I sat on the floor right behind this chair and painted and my right leg went numb and was throbbing for about 20 minutes. All for you. We do it with love in our hearts. Today, we filmed a couple Patreon exclusive tutorials. That's what I was talking about when I mentioned that my leg went numb um, for about 20 minutes. Um, I painted a wisteria tutorial, a wisteria tree, and it was super fun. And if you didn't watch my latest video about swatching all of the colors from my Mary Blue, the new brand that I'm using for watercolor, um, we that today's tutorials that we filmed were the first ever tutorials where I'm only using my Mary. And so it was super fun to get even more comfortable with the pigments um, and um, mixing up, you know, com a bunch of different combinations for like a light gray and light taupey colors for the trunk. I'm still familiarizing myself with the names of these colors, but um, if you're a part of my art school, my Patreon, then you will be getting that exclusive tutorial. And then there's another exclusive tutorial for the higher up tiers um, that we filmed today as well, which was like a garden rose, kind of moody fall color palette. 
um, wet and wet style watercolor painting and it was bomb. So both of those tutorials are gonna be coming out next month for my patrons only. So if you uh, wanna check it out, jennarainey.com forward slash Patreon uh, to join my art school. I have live monthly um, Q and A's, live monthly art classes, two exclusive tutorials per month, depending on which tier you're part of. And then it comes with a community with hundreds of the students um, chatting with each other, asking questions, giving feedback, inspiration. And then I'm in there all the time as well, giving feedback, asking questions, posting stuff. So check it out. Well, that is all folks. Thanks for coming to my living room today uh, and for touring the Dusty Studio with me. Um, and I hope you are just as excited about the studio renovations as I am um, and for them to be done. Also, if you wanna check out my new course that's coming out in November, The Art Within, um, where I'm gonna be showing how to unlock and master the foundations of your art skills so that you can unlock your creative potential, your inner artist, and tap into the flow state and all the science behind flow state, why it's beneficial and how to incorporate some sort of process that works for you in order to unlock that flow state and create your best work. So if you wanna check that out, The Art Within is going to be coming out November, 2022. Our waitlist our wait for it is jennarainey.com forward slash art dash studio dash waitlist. Check it out. It's going to be awesome, super in depth, lots of guest expert interviews, um, wide range of tools and modalities to check out too, like meditation, breath work, flow state drawing exercises, uh, foundations, like I said, of art and sketching and drawing and watercolor. And then it goes even further and we talk about sunlight. I have a bunch of interviews with people who are circadian medicine experts and then also some nutrition experts um, and how to create balance within your body so that you can use your brain and your hands uh, effectively together to create your best work. So if you're interested, check that link out. Thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed all of the life updates and the little tour of our dusty studio. Um, and as always, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.